Okay, we're back. We're going to ta continue talking about lines and our command options, okay? So uh, what we're going to do now is, is talk about line from both sides in the command option. Uh, but it, you don't necessarily need to take it. For, if you click on line, you have it down here. You can click on a line, uh, both directions from here. And again, you probably want to stick with... Uh, the yellow uh, for creation when using lines uh, but you can also uh, go in here and click line from both sides as well uh, so it's uh, you know two different ways of using it this one's pretty simple and pretty basic so let's go ahead and click on it and check our uh, uh, options out normal and actually we'll talk about those as we go but so uh, basically uh, you click uh, it'll give you your line there and then you can come down here command line and let's just say we want it five millimeters on both sides uh, so it'll lock it in that direction you can hold down shift and add it to any direction right uh, and then hit enter uh, or right click to end the command so you have it uh, 10 to 10 millimeters and if you want to know exactly you can type in len length and hit enter and it will tell you in your command line how f far that line is or how long that line is by typing in length so again just type on it and then l-e-n-g-t-h length and you can see right there length 10 millimeters okay so that's a uh, pretty basic really so let's go ahead and just uh you can also uh go to your uh and you see right there it pops up if you right click on it you could just go ahead and activate the line from both sides and i have my near and end on so if i go here and uh toward my in my mid so if i go to mid and then i can draw a line and again i can change it to a certain amount a length say that's 15 millimeters and now it'll lock it into 50 millimeters if i hold down shift it'll lock it in 45 and 90 degree angles pretty much basically the same thing so a uh, line from both uh, curves uh you know there's still a lot of other options in there uh if i go to line both curves you, you still have all these options which we're going to get into and we're going to talk about a normal next uh actually uh the one thing that i kind of use line for both sides for just to give you an example is if i'm in my tools and i have a ring rail out here uh, and we'll go to all perspectives uh, what i usually use the line from both sides is i'm going to go down here to my command line right click line from both sides uh, f4 snap it into f4 and then i just draw a line kind of trying to get my shape or my the thickness of my uh shank like that something like that sometimes uh and then i can manipulate around this way but we'll talk about that uh, uh later on down the line uh so that's kind of line from both sides pretty basic just gives you a line from both directions nothing uh, spectacular here all right so we'll go on to a normal which uh if you're not uh familiar with normal uh, in your command line, uh, I think you'll find it very useful at times. So we'll go ahead and talk about that one next.